So aliens part four and the light and the projection. Um, we need to understand these things because we're going from one plan it to the next plan it. The new heaven and earth. What, what, what am I planning in my life? Okay. So and the net, that play on the net. That where man is, is that. You need to look at the projection backwards and see how it is condensing and understand. I'm trying to put together all things of the so-called truth or community of the last 24 years, so-called, since it so-called started. But I was actually in the libraries at 14, 15, 16 years reading about the New World Order and all these things. So I was kind of exposing these things. And then I heard as a child, in times and teenage years, I did some math and you, it, it set it upon my heart about end times. And I kind of lived my life based on end times and seeking out these things, basically getting all the light of the candlesticks that Jesus talks about in Revelation, going into all these churches, going into all these parts of the world, getting the candle lit up, and hey, realize, hey, I gotta overcome this. Hey, I gotta hate this. Hey, I gotta do I gotta I gotta do this. I gotta take care of this temple. I gotta do whatever. So as we are given these things in our lives, the ebbs and flows, all right? <clears throat> The <clears throat> world is set up where it's, if you look at the, <clears throat> if you look at nature, when we're lost and going downstream, get into the little crooks and crannies and areas or the dark swamps or whatever, it's hard to make our way back out. So, <clears throat> the light is being given in one way, but that light is being taken in another. All right, so there, there's very simple, it, it, the sun, Everything in this world begins with that sun. Okay? It gives life to all things. <clears throat> but the sun can only be brought to life if there's darkness first. And that's where darkness goes upon the deep. Okay? So this is where our world is going into a darkness. And this is where Jesus comes into the world during these religious times, during these times of conflict or whatever, and he's coming into us, just like he did with Noah, Joseph, Eve, all these things, and he's operating within the lower chakra, and he's coming up, and he's right, hey, something's not right here. Something, I gotta get the light, right? So, as man is being given all these different lights, all these begotten sons, all these religions, all these candles, are being brought out into this world, all right? We, it once we get lost or get down to this creek, all right, if the creek's drying up until there's rain again or whatever, you, you, you might not be able to, there's, if you've ever walked a creek, sometimes it gets into an area that you may not know where the creek is, okay? Um, and, and you have to know other points around you, other points of light to make it back to the path, to make it back to where you came from. All right. So <clears throat> we all came from light. We all start at the central point of light. All right. The, the older we grow, the further away we grow from the light inside of us because the lights out there are trying to control us. All right, so this is the test of this light. And as the test of this light, we're going from one phase to the other, one world stage to the other. And as 
we can view these things <clears throat> um, with sorrow. We need to understand these things of how the cycle continues and the light is regenerated. And, and they just weren't ready for these times. And they had to be born into the times because it's a dark light and it has to be it has to be given a whole new filament or whatever okay because there's a light inside of us and, and when we realize that we're this bulb right and we're only given so much time before this bulb is shattered and we can do things to strengthen this glass to become a bulletproof glass in a way and the structure of a bulb is, is kind of a teardrop. And if you, a teardrop is actually one of the strongest uh, shapes or whatever, but it can also be a very fragile shape if it's, if it's made um, with, with uh, the wrong elements, all right? So <clears throat> the elements, the mints, the L, the L's tied to the drunkenness, the winds, the mints tied to the money, the currencies that control man. <clears throat> so, the world stage is giving one thing of aliens and they're rounding up the old and all these things. Okay, so... Um, <laughs> The things that we're told as far as the so-called truth community, the shapeshifters, all these things, this is a time to people where there's like a few people running the show, all right? And they're wearing masks or now they're doing the deep fakes and all these things. And, and um, <clears throat> while they're telling you the AI, uh, there's many, that's a whole nother rabbit trope of the live stuff. Um, they're testing what's real and what's not real. The Israel, the Israel, and as um, the Israel and Israel are all being uh, brought to a test and they're being open and exposed or whatever, this is where um, the lights are going to be divided and taken in and all these things because you're in that like, and the, you're in the final four. All right. So as the the um final force upon everybody that's when the most the lowest of lower shocker people that's when it's going to take them like two and a half three years to be like i finally get it i'm finally i think there's something going on or whatever right the more centered centered the one you're not reflecting that light per se but you're inside you the more centered and more in tune with the world you're going to be shaken now starting in the final four, and then it's going to vibrate through the waters, okay? So as the trumpets, trumpets sounded to that so-called church in Revelation 4, that me that heard it, all right, whoever's reading that, because Jesus is inside of us, it just told us about the false churches, those false lights. God is light. So this is where man is worshiping that that candlestick that begotten son that's where jesus is coming out against the begotten son so the jesus amen amen the amen raw we are all that light that's what he's telling man y'all it just goes on and on there's so much to break down the church the church being left behind or whatever so, the first or last, the, the, we can kind of count this down, like it can either be a four-year time frame or a 20-year time frame. And this be kind of tied into those four and 20 elders per se, but that four-year time, the final four, that's when the church is like completely broken down. They're taken into their bell worship and all this other stuff right and then we can see the 20 years after that where they're confined and they finally come out of the wilderness and out of their bondage and they're let loose again okay we can see these things in history 
And as we can see these things in history, we can see the concentration camps that were brought in, uh, different world wars and such in different ways, shapes and forms. We can see how that's going to be coming to America again. And it's all going to be in the final four. And all these things coming at the final four are all going to make things rise and take us into the new age and new time frame and all that stuff. So this is where the aliens are coming upon the earth. And your God, your so-called religion, your book of Moses, from one Moses to another Moses, from one tablet to another tablet, from one light to another light, one mountain to another mountain. All these things are happening like in a big overall way as they're happening. Ding, 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 ding. It's like a house of cards, but it's like a spiritual house of cards to a physical house of cards from light to light to carnal. Once you understand that, it goes back to basic science, dude. Light is particles. We are matter, which is condensed light, condensed particles. We are atoms, the atoms. We are the positive and negative, the Eve, all these things. The light versus the dark. But the dark, the shadow, the sun, right, works. But the shadow works around. The white devil stands still while the dark ones circle around. And, and do the world. So this is where we're just seeing like one sun to another sun, the white throne judgment to one light to the other light. And when, when <clears throat> your temple goes down, when the things you have faith in, markets, food, whatever, that sh goes out and then a new one is presented, that's when that sun, that dark sun comes out because that light inside of you has gone dark. That sun the moon, the dark, the blood moon. That's all within us. That's all going to happen within us. It's going to happen out there as it happens within here. Because we are the earth. The earth is within us and the earth is cleansing itself. As it's cleansing itself, it's moving those that need to be taken out, out. As it's moving those who need to be cleansed, they're cleansing. That's why you see people doing a detox right now. That's why you see the Oz Impic. People trying to lose weight and trying to transform their body, trying to get caught up. They're trying to get caught up. They know shit's coming. The spirit, the light, and sun, they may not know. A lot of, most people don't know what the fuck they're doing or why they're doing it. It's because the heaven and earth is changing. The old is going out and the, the light inside of them knows it, but the body doesn't because the body's part of the world stage and the light's being controlled by this projection, that projection, whatever. And depending where the entombment is, where that single eye is, how close it is to the center will depend on how much of the light is controlling the body. That's where people are like just trying to do their diets or detox or whatever. Okay, because they're trying to lose the heavy metals. The heavy metals are keeping you low. They're keeping you low. And when you get low, that metal burns. And when the metal gets hot and melts down, it has no compass, it has no magnetic pole. So this is when the Don just can come up and he makes his new infinity glove, or he makes his new trident, or his new hammer. <clears throat> that you're shown in the visions and the televisions. We're going to hear, hear and then do another alien one. <laughs>